Hey everybody, it's Dean DaCosta of The Search Authority, and today we're talking about a tool called Social Searcher. As you can see here, you can search for profiles, and keep in mind, profiles of people on Facebook, LinkedIn, Instagram, uh, I'm not sure what these other two are, to be quite frank and honest with you. Let's see, Vimeo and Dailymotion. There we go, it says it right there. Duh. So you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to be smart. Well, maybe I'm not so smart. We're going to do Java developer. I don't know why I always pick on Java developer, but I do. And we're going to go enter and we're going to see what happens. Let's see. Real time search in five sources. Thinking, thinking, thinking. That's my robot voice. Okay, and look what we got here. We got a Venmo person being a Java developer. We got a game developer and whatever that's called, Daily Motion, Daily Motion, Daily Motion, LinkedIn. I like this. This is interesting. Look at all this. And there's more. Become premium to load more. Okay, fine, whatever. It doesn't matter. These are free. And that I find interesting in that. Now, what I also find interesting is if I come up here and I look at this, I see some interesting information. So let's see what would happen if we created an x-ray or something like that to to do this exact thing let's go ahead and grab this so this is going to be a dual class today boys and girls um not trying to be condescending just you know and let's look at this http so if we were to change that and make that a site command and we come all the way out to here to this what would happen but let's before we do that let's do this and let's get let's see what happens if we just get rid of all, everything here but the java and the developer Will it still work? Let's go ahead and copy that, come up here, paste that in the Omnibox, and open it up and see what happens. It'll be curious. Not found. So you do need that extra stuff. Okay, now knowing that, we have this site search. So let's see what happens if we copy that. And we come up here, and of course we're going to use Google for now. And we put all that in there and do a Google search. Hmm, only four results. Isn't that interesting? Now, let's go to more and more Prime. Let's come over here and look at my tool here real quick and see, do I have a social searcher area? I may, I may not. Well, I don't down there. Let's go somewhere more specific. Usernames, real names. Did I? Ah, look at that. Social searcher. Okay, let's see what happens here. If we do Dean DaCosta, we populate all and we do a social searcher search. Ah, look at that, boys and girls. It's working. Isn't that interesting? So we can create a tool out of this, which I've already done in, in my tool, uh, my version of my tool, by the way. Um, so that's interesting enough. So now knowing that, let's go back. And, and you guys are getting kind of an insight into my, into my mindset here. Let's see what happens if we put this whole thing as is in here, which we didn't before. I think we only put part of it and we tried to tear it apart. Okay, we only get four. So that's telling me that there's a problem here. So let's go ahead and do this search again and find out what is the URL we used here. Let's get this out of the way, copy, come back to our, our editor here so we can see what we're doing. I'll put it in there. So Dean, da, 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 da. So this is all standard. This is all standard. So let's see what would happen and that's the actual AT. Okay, so here's what happened. Up here, we did a site search. Down here, I created my tool telling it to go there. And then inside the code, which you don't get to see, I said add my name with a plus and DaCosta. So that's why. So you can't x ray into it to get it to work, but you can create a bit of a custom search engine or just a regular straight pull like I did with my tool to get it to work. Let's see, am I using that same process anywhere else by chance? Yep, I'm using it for usernames. And what would be the other one? I might try for email addresses. Yep, I'm using it for email addresses. So I'm using a social searcher for a lot of things. So let's see, let, let's change this and let's add an email address. Let's do mine. This way I'm not picking on anybody else because who knows I don't want to pick on anybody else. And let's let it do its thing. Real time search in five seconds, four, Three, two, oh, I'm late. And there you go. By the way, you can export this whole list right there, by the way. So you don't even need to scrape it. And we got my email. There's me. There's someone probably linking to something that's related to me. I can't see what all these are, but it, you get the general idea. So that's how Social Searcher works. It is a great tool, a great site. You could search based on titles, based on emails, based on names, based on um, just about whatever you really want. And you'll see if there are anywhere out there. Um, for me, 
I like it. I don't even care about the to load more, do premium, because frankly, if I know they're on Vimo, I can go into Vimo. If I know they're on whatever that is, I can go in there. Uh, if I know they're on LinkedIn, I can go in there. If they know they're on Facebook, I can go in there. This just lets me know if they're there and which one they're at before I go wasting my time. And that's the idea. So and you also got to see a little thought process behind I work. And let, let me let me show you a little bit more about what I mean by what I did here. Um, so you got all these here. So I did the search based on my name or and based on jobs. Well, what would happen if we just went in here and retyped the URL and put in um, HTML and developer? Probably not the best one in the world to do, but we're going to do it anyway. And we're going to go up here, put it in the Omnibox, push enter. It's thinking five, four. Well, I've been long on my time, so I'm not going to count this time around. Let's see if it works. This is what I mean by URL manipulation and badam. There we go. So that's the URL manipulation. So the way I put the code into my tool is I've said basically open this and then add the word I put in the first box and put a plus in between them and add the second box. That's kind of how the tool got made. So there you go. But social search is a good tool, whether you use it this way or through my own tool or any other way. Great tool, helps you out, does a job. My name is Dean DeCosta of the Search Authority. This is Social Seeker, Social Searcher, excuse me. May the source be with you.